So today I am at the airport and I'm going to one of my favorite destinations, which is Spain. I just love it. When you want to have nice apartment on a hill view of the sea, so you have to climb on the on the mountain. I just feel like I don't know. Missouri. It's like one and a half kilometer of climbing to the hill to reach apartment. I also noticed one thing, the way people are living here, just see. Like you cannot see anything what they have next to their houses. Everything covered and and they have amazing views from the balcony. All the Malaga city and see it was amazing very nice peaceful place with amazing view just see the view there behind amazing oh. everything covered you know, so you not see anything what people have privacy First class. <laughs> so this is how people live here on this hill. This view they have from their balconies. <sighs> have to climb a little bit to reach here, but it's worth it. The third day. I just got my first chodo. It cost 50 cents. Yeah. <laughs> and now just opposite the street that is you can just cross the street and just go to the port and there are also a lot of, a lot of cafes and restaurants, places to eat, to just chill, enjoy, a lot of music, the jazz are of I'm just uh, nearby the port now and uh, I'm gonna rent a bike. Uh, so the name of the place is Cuckoo Bikes and uh, I will rent a bike for 5 hours and I will pay 10 euros. You have to also pay deposit 30 euros, which obviously they give you back later. place in Ma for uh, ice cream. I got some some flavor with orange and with pistachios. It's all melting so I'm just eating very fast. <laughs> All over the city you have the special tracks for the bikes so you can just roam around and enjoy this beautiful view on bike and you don't have to be worried about the cars and this people walking you have just all track for yourself <laughs> this gym cycles also student and
else about uh, Spanish supermarket is that you can get fresh oranges. This machine is here. And fresh oranges you can get from here. So there's a very good small bottle or almost two euros and then one liter bottle. And this goes up. This is how it looks. Typical Spanish supermarket. <laughs> restrictions here in Malaga uh, due to COVID. Uh, so in the restaurants and uh, I mean restaurants and everything is open. You can go outside on the beach and uh, on the street there are these kind of lines here to keep distance like two meters. And uh, you don't have to wear masks outside just inside the buildings. But I can see that a lot of people here, especially local ones, they are uh, still wearing masks outside. And uh, right now there's no any problem. As I said before, from Poland, even you can uh, come here without uh, any test or vaccination. Everything is working normally right now. As of now, like it's September 2021, so, so right now everything is working. Everything is open. Guys, I just found one Indian restaurant, Tandoori Touch. Let's see what they have here. I will just show you guys the most popular bar in Malaga. The owner of this bar is uh, Antonio Banderas. <laughs> so a lot of, lot of people are here and there is a big queue. The name of uh, this place is El Pimki. And yeah, it's very popular bar here. <laughs> Guys, I have for you like few tips uh, before coming here to Malaga. Uh, I would recommend you to uh, take some Spanish course or be prepared with some <laughs> Spanish words because here people don't speak in English so much. They just speak uh, Spanish, so it's not very easy to communicate. But even in restaurants, in the shops. They just are not able to understand you in English. Yeah, but <laughs> you can practice your Spanish. And second thing is uh, that I really recommend you to come here on September because July and August is the peak season for tourists here. So like all the beaches and, and uh, even streets there in the city are very crowded. The temperature also is very high, so it's very difficult to go sightseeing in the city as lying here on the beach as well. And now is the weather is very nice and uh, you can just lie down. Beaches are not very crowded. Also like in the city there are not many people. Uh, no, but yeah, like in the evening you can find, uh, as always here in Malaga, in the old uh, town, there are lots of people. They are, it's, Malaga is all about tapas, so people are going out uh, to have a drink, to have tapas. And now the weather is very nice. It's like less than 30 Celsius. Also, I mean, the water is not very hot. It's like Guys, I just want to tell you about uh, one very famous thing here in Malaga. It's uh, called uh, Chiringuito. Chiringuito is this kind of restaurant just next to the beach. So you can get here 
all the dishes with seafood, fish, some drinks, other some typical Spanish uh, cuisine. I'm just standing here next to Chiringuito Mediterraneo. <laughs> I'll get some typical thing with this uh, paella. It's kind of like rice. They serve it with, uh, like with vegetables or with fish, whatever you want. later uh, now I just want to show you how this kind of chiringuito looks uh, at night this is one of them chiringuito oasis so I am currently at the airport it's 5 a.m. so I'm just very sleepy because I didn't sleep all night and uh, I'm just waiting for my flight is in about one and a half hour and yeah so that's all uh, my, my trip is ending right now and I really recommend Malaga to everyone and yeah that's all for today and thank you again for watching it, this vlog and see you soon Buenas noches, adios